uh, civil war I'm talking about uh, lions here is when the war that is being the silent war was well, not too silent the silent war if you want to call it right um, being loose with words here the silent war that governments in Western countries are waging war on their citizens might turn hot so it's not a regional war it's not a war about uh, borders it's a war about rights right that's really what a civil war is to me it's not about drawing boundaries it's about rights and Western governments right Western oligarchs have taken and taken away human rights of their citizens for the last in the last three years in a big way it really in the United States it started with the Patriot Act of course right that was a trigger for me once the Patriot Act got passed right and it kept on being renewed it told us something it said that the government is going to continue waging war on its own citizens end of story and Western governments followed that lead right because who calls the shots in the Western world is the United States okay so they follow that we lead so for the last 20 years 22 years Western governments have been waging war on their own citizens what's gonna break the camel's back right what's gonna break the camel's back Canada became very close to it right the trucker movement in Canada right that was a legit grassroots movement from everyday Canadians saying enough is fucking enough right you can't prevent us from working are you crazy right you can't force us to not have bodily autonomy are you fucking crazy right and they did a movement this is not over by the way this is not over, not by a long shot right not by a long shot right that's what I mean with a civil war I think Europe is gonna see it soon certain parts probably right probably remember remember gang remember okay before the rollout of uh, sweet Sweden for sanity calls it the f forcing people to drink tea and the lockdowns and stuff like this what was going on in the world really what was going on in the world before all these lockdowns and the thing that came from there possibly came from there when all over what was going on in the world there was mass protests everywhere in the world there was mass protests everywhere in the world right from South America to Central America to Canada United States Canada not so much right Canada's pretty sleepy right that's why they were able to do what it is they're doing right but in the United States in Europe in France yellow vest there was mass protests in, mass protests in Asia all over the world there was mass protests and then magically something came along and those lockdowns right what's going on what's going on right 